name is Grace, and today I'm going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is A Hairy Tale. Samson, let's read. Again, God's people disobeyed him, so God let Philistines rule over them for 40 years. Then, he chose a man named Samson to set them free. So again, God's people forgot God. Forget God. So they have sinned so much and they have, they have believed the false God. So God let Palestine rule over them for 40 years and God chose a man named Samson to set the Israel free. So God let the Palestines rule over them for 40 years, then God sent Samson. An angel promised Samson's mother that the that she would have to make three promises to God. Never drink wine, never touch dead things, never cut his hair. So Angel came to Samson's mother. She's, the Angel said, Samson must not never touch. Touch dead things, never drink wine, and never cut his hair. So, the first promise was never drink wine, okay. never touch the dead things. Number three, never cut his hair. So, Samsung must do the do three promises. Never drink wine, never touch dead things, never cut his hair. God made Samson very strong. He killed a lamb and and bees made honey. And its body, Samson touched the dead lion, breaking one of his promises to God. He even ate honey. So God made Samson very strong. But Samson strength. Samson's strength was in his hair. So God told him never cut his hair. But Samson had break one of God's promise. He have touched the dead thing. That lion and also he have ate the honey. Question goodness. Question Samson has promised God that he would never drink wine, cut his hair, or touch that thing. True. Samson fell in love with a woman named Delilah. The Palestines promised her a lot of money to discover why Samson was so strong. She asked him again and again. So Samson fell in love with Delilah, a woman named Delilah. The Palestines promised her a lot of money. 
So, the law was kept asking, but Samson lied, and like, first time, like, he have said, if you something something that it, my strength will go and really Darilla did that <laughs> I, I don't know why he wants <laughs> Finally, Samson told Darla his secret. If my hair is cut, my strength will go. So while he slept, Darla called for a man to cut off his hair. Samson's strength left him. So Darla called the Palestine soldier that the strength is coming from his hair. So he have she have got lots of money. Neither <laughs> so is so bad, but also Samson has done wrong because he have told her his secret. When the Philistines arrived, they captured him easily. They blind him. They put him in a prison and set him to work, dragging a heavy grinding stone. So, Philistines arrived to capture him. He have captured them easily and they make Samson blind and put them in a prison and set him to work. Drinking a heavy stone. There's they have blind Samson. Question who conserved by Samson to tell his secret and the Subi got by having her, his haircut number one Darilla Slowly Samson's hair grew back the Philistines brought Samson into their temple to Thank their for false god, Dagon, for defeating Samson. Samson asked God to make him strong one last time. So Samson's hair grew. The Philistines brought Samson to their temple and thank the false god. They're so bad. Also, they have one. Um, oh sorry, a big false god, and Samson's hair was growing, so Samson asked God. Samson stood between the pillars to push on them. The temple fell down, killing all the Philistines, the Samson, and Samson with them. Samson didn't keep his promise, but God kept his. So Samson stood between and crashed the wall. And Samson did not keep his promise, but God kept Samson's. God kept his promise every time. Question. Did God make Samson strong one last time that his people would be free from the Palestines? True. 
we have got the star. Yes, today I read the Bible story. Did you enjoy it? And next time I will read another good story. Then let's see you next time. Bye!